My name's Pam Palmiter, and I'm a lawyer and professor at Ryerson University. I'm currently the chair in Indigenous Governance. Uh, why I came to be doing all of this work is because I'm a Mi'kmaq woman, I'm a member of Eel River Bar First Nation, and I have really strong ties to my home territory in the Maritime Provinces and to the Mi'kmaq Nation. My family really raised me to be this way. The person who actually encouraged me to pick UNB was former Judge Graydon Nicholas. He was also the former Lieutenant Governor for New Brunswick. He used to teach Aboriginal law at St. Thomas University University and he really sparked my interest at a time when people were trying to encourage me to be an engineer, an accountant, and a whole bunch of other professions. He was really focused on the need for justice in First Nations and said that a law degree at UMB Law School would be a critical foundation for helping me move, move forward and do that for First Nations. UNB Law School really shaped who I am today because of the quality of education that I got there and the passion of the professors. So we didn't just learn the nuts and bolts of criminal law, constitutional law, and Aboriginal law, but we also learned to critique those laws and how those laws could be made better. I think my favorite memory about my time at UMB Law School is all the times when I was able to bring my small children, Mitchell and Jeremy, to class with me. Uh, it was one of the hardest periods of my life. I was a single mom and uh, trying to get through law school and raise two babies and all of my social justice work, but the professors at UNB were extremely supportive. And not supportive in the sense of being tolerant, but supportive in the sense of being encouraging and kind of going with the flow. So I could go to the library and my babies would be crawling around on the floor and the librarians would be playing with them while I picked out the books for my courses. It was a, a sense of community, both by the professors and all the students, that helped me get through law school. And I never could have graduated without that kind of support from the professors.